Zenith Prep Academy has spent the last 15 years perfecting the college admissions strategy by giving guidance, having worked with more than a thousand families, both nationally and internationally. And with me is Kevin Hong, the program director at uh, Zenith Prep Academy. So, of course, I told you I have a 13-year-old and a 15-year-old, sure. so I'm right in the middle of what you do. Um, but it's never been harder, right, for a kid to get into the college that they prefer. So. What does Zenith do to help them in that process? Sure, you know, I'm glad you asked that. I think every single year, more and more students apply to college, and last year, to no one's surprise, there was a record-breaking number of applicants. And so, given how competitive things are in today's current college admissions environment, I think the most important thing that we do for these parents and students is really taking them from reactive to proactive so they can take control of the admissions process. You know, it's hard to stand out to these universities if you're just doing the same things as everyone else. And so, the focus that we've always had here is really working with each student Student and understanding their strengths both in and outside the classroom because ultimately that's what helps them stand out in the admissions process. Now you have worked with, I said, a thousand families. So, I mean, what, and then you must have a track record of success and there's a lot of word of mouth, I assume. What do you attribute your success to? Sure, I think bottom line, we get these parents and students results. And I think a large part of that is not just giving them peace of mind, but also comfort as they go through the process. You know, there's so many unknowns when it comes to college admissions. And so by being able to take them through the process, not only are are we able to set the right expectations, but also give them a proven roadmap that we know is going to work? Yeah. And then what makes you different from some of the other? There's quite a few sure. college prep organizations out there. How is Zenith different? You know, I think the standard approach out there is to optimize for the university. And the approach that we've always taken here is to really optimize for the student. I think it's easy to say, you know, here are some top universities. Here's a checklist of things to do. It's just one, two, three. There's like some kind of template out there, right? But the reality is that each student is really inherently different from another and so the focus has always been to really work with the student right figure out what they're good at help them double and triple down on their strengths uh, because that's what colleges ultimately want to see they want to see a student that knows what they want right can get really good at something and really focus on that mm -hmm. what kind of parents hire you you know I would say more than anything it's really the parents of 6th to 12th graders that really care about their child's education I think across America what's really important for parents is really helping their child just achieve the best and I think as any parent you know can tell you the most valuable thing that you can give your child is really options in life and so for us we really work with two demographics of students right the first are students that are high academic achievers as we call them and so these are students that are going to get all A's they have a top GPA and SAT score and for them it's really preventing them from getting rejected by a top university and the reason for that is having a top GPA and SAT score no longer guarantees admission even into a top 25 school and I think that's what shocks a lot of these parents mm -hmm. and the second type of student are students that don't have the best GP and SAT scores. And for them, it's really about helping them get into a better university than they otherwise thought was possible. Now, the good news is that here in the United States, we have what we call a holistic admissions process. And that's just a long way of saying you can get into a better university, right? Your GP and SAT score don't necessarily dictate the universities that you have to attend, right? So the truth is, it's easier than most parents and students think. And that's exactly what we've done here for the last 15 years oh, for our families. So what would be one piece of advice you would give like the first piece of advice you give to a family take your time be prepared like what would you say you know I would say more than anything right I think when it comes to working with these students, you know, even from just a strategy perspective, right? I think the goal that we always have here is to really help the child become the best possible version of themselves. I think there's this really, you know, common misconception that what's most important is that you have to be like hyper intelligent, right? It's all about pure intelligence to get into a really good college. When in reality, and this is the advice I would give any parent or student, is that it's really about giving the child as much time as possible, right? Time is what allows for a child to figure out what their strengths are, exponentially grow those strengths, and then continue doing that over enough time so they can really stand out in the admissions process. Well, super interesting. I'm going to be living it very soon. So sure. <laughs> thank you so much, Kevin. No problem. Thank you, Jane. Thanks.